Hello everyone, um, I'm playing through, uh, the, the, uh, the Simpsons arcade game, it's for MAME. This game came out when the Simpsons, I think it was only in, like, season 2 or 3, some shit like that, I think it was, like, season 2. Uh, I, I, um, so yeah, it's an old Simpsons game, it's really good apparently, it's, a, it's one of the better arcade beat-em-ups I've heard, it's more wacky. I can only play as Marge, you have to play as, you have to like, be the other players to play as the other ones, and I don't know how to do that on my emulator, and I don't care enough. You can hear when you insert a coin. So this is a cutscene. There's cutscenes too, these cutscenes are cool. When you insert a coin, it plays like the Simpsons jingle, which is nice. So yeah. So, in terms of beating up, this feels very smooth. Like these, these is real. This is really not stiff at all. Very smooth. Like, it, like it's even. I know it's for the arcade, not like a home console, so it's easier to be smooth. But this actually feels. This is incredibly smooth. It's also not. It doesn't take fifty years to beat up one enemy. I also do like these sound effects. I have never played this beat'em before. I've never played this before, by the way. I just want to make that clear. I don't think I've ever played any Simpsons video game before. Not even Simpsons Hit and Run. I know I've committed a sin. The, the Simpsons... That Hit and Run is fun. Like, the world of Springfield is fun. But the actual, like, game story gameplay of that game is, like, really repetitive. It's not a bad game, though. I'm not saying it's shit. I just think some people think it's, like, it's, oh, oh they overhype it. It's a good game, but some people act like it's, like, I don't know, the second coming of G Jesus. I don't know. I'm sorry, the first boss. Sorry, I just, like... How do you like? Okay. Okay. I'm gaming right now, guys. Why does his pants come down? Why do his pants come undone? Holy shit, this guy takes so many hits. <laughs> he's just flickering now. There we go. He w he's dead. Oh, what's next? Are we going to Krusty the Clown Land now? Oh, it's a bonus stage. Hit buttons. I'm blowing up my balloon. Oh, I got third. Okay. Oh, but I still I still was able to go after Yeah, we're going to Crusty Land, okay. Yeah, this is definitely not based off season one. You can tell because uh what's what's his name? Smithers? Yeah, he was black in season one. And they realized it was kind of weird for a rich guy to have his, like, second hand, his, like, his, like, the guy he bosses around to be, you know, like, that was a weird, you know what I mean. So, yeah, they changed him to be white. I'm pretty sure in season one, uh, the police officer, what's his name, Chief Wiggum, I'm pretty sure, he, yeah, he had, like, black hair in season one. I'm pretty sure. Uh, in season one, Ned Flanders was a lot more stuck up. Like, he was annoying. Um... Oh my god, it's this guy, Tim Monroe or whatever. Yeah, you really only seen him in, like, season one, maybe two. And they just never showed him again. They mentioned him in a later episode, in a, I, I, an episode in the laser season, I remember that. Oh, it's Millhouse. 
What's up, Millhouse? Yeah, it's best you get out of here. These people in the cups, they're, they're crazy. What was that? My face just became big. Marge's face just became big. The Simpsons is a good show. I think Family Guy is worse than Simpsons. Well, it used to be a good show. But I think Peak Simpsons, like, Simpsons, I would say, started, started to become... Worse, like, I think Peak Simpsons was, like, season 1 to 7. Peak Family Guy was, like, season 2 to, like, 5 or something. The Rabbits of Evil. No, they're just furries, never mind. Is this the actual, the actual Krusty? Oh my god, these guys th are so annoying. They, like, chuck hats at you. No, it was just an imposter. Oh dear, great heavens! What the frick is that? What is that, Nightmare Fool? That is not- I thought we'd be fighting, like, Krusty. Not whatever the fuck this is. This is, like, not Krusty. Holy- Oh my god. Holy crow! I'm just sort of like tank. I don't know the strats for this, you know. Oh my god. Oh, he blew up. Okay, so that actually wasn't Krusty. Is this how Marge dies, guys? We're gonna watch Marge die. Oh no, they just land in trees. Alright. And now we're at the cemetery. I do think Marge is the best Reach. I don't know. I was looking up who the best character is, and apparently it's a pretty... A lot of, some people say it's Bart. Some people say it's Marge. I'm not sure what Lisa does. Homer just looks like a, the basic character. Oh, one coin gives you two lives? I thought it was only giving me one before. I do think arcade emulation is like one of the best things ever because a lot of arcade games you can only play, you can't, it's hard to play them. But obviously, no, no one's owning an actual arcade. Like some arcade games are released later, but like on like, I don't know, like collection things, but not all of them. Now we're fighting the undead.
Oh my god. Bro, what are these ones? These ones, like, dig under the ground and then they go... What even? Where? What cemetery? What, like... What grave are we in? Oh, you can knock people over, that's cool. Well, I mean, knock them off. guys they're like pointing at me but i'm not there <laughs> that's funny they were like that's like the point that like, they were supposed to be pointing at me clearly maybe go after the little one i can tank these hits God, the little one is so... B okay, well, I was gonna say the little one's so bad by itself, but, um... Okay, does this one just have more health than the big guy? Oh, I see. He's dodging a lot of my actual hits. I see. Alright. There we go, God. That guy was dodgy. What the fuck, we're at Moe's Tavern now? Hey, yo, what's that poster? Are we gonna fight Mo? That'd be funny. Yeah, this isn't exactly how big I remember Moe's Tavern being. Oh, there he is. There is Mo. Hello. Oh, you can't attack. There's a guy like the. Okay, so we're not fighting Mo. Hey yo! Oh, it's that one guy, the musical guy. God, these broom people have reach.
Alright. Oh dear. Who are you? Oh my god, this guy breathes fire. I guess these are probably people from the old show, I just don't know, or don't remember. Clearly this man is not in the best spot mentally. Oh, now he's dead. Or, well, he got beaten up. Now he's fading away. I, I think this game's like about 40 minutes long. Also, my Golden Axe... Uh, well, I'm I hope I post that video before this because I'm going to look like a dummy if I don't. My Golden Axe Death Adder gameplay video... It is so. I, I I thought I I don't I think I took like the longest route possible in the game because it took me like an hour to beat it. And I looked at videos and most people it only took them like forty five ish minutes. Where the heck are we now? And like we're in the zoo. Oh, I don't want to fight animals. That's me. We're gonna have to fight you guys. Sorry. Guys, I'm beating up animals. Call PETA. Call them. Nelson. No, Nelson. Come up here. Yeah, that's what I thought. Get get wrecked. It's Sideshow Bob when he wasn't crazy and wasn't a serial killer. Actually, no, I don't think he's a serial killer. He just he's just evil. Yeah, I do know. I am not a Simpsons noob. I know a lot about the show. It's a bear. Kill it. Bear gets beaten up by mom in vacuum. With a vacuum. Truly riveting. God, the rocks are more difficult than the bear. The bear is, this is like the easiest boss. Okay, now it's doing a rolling attack. I changed I change back what I said.
Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, the the hardest part about this boss were the rocks. Like that was the most Oh, it was just magic, okay. Yeah, it wasn't even that hard. Swim. I... Bruh. Oh no, we're fighting. This is. What the frick is this? God, this is one of the. The article I read about this game. The oh, briefly skim through, I should say. Was right. This is like one of the drunk, most drunk beat em ups ever. Like, it's not a bad way. Nah, we're in Dreamland. Kirby's Dreamland reference? School? Holy shit, these enemies are annoying. How do you hit these guys? Okay, I got one. Oh, that's all I need to get. Bro, when your, their head falls off, you don't even defeat them. Back, savages. Oh yeah, when Marge gets electrocuted in this game, you can see she has rabbit ears, and there, that's actually a reference. And apparently, at the end of season one, it was going to reveal, be revealed that Marge is like a rabbit or some shit. I don't know if it was going to be like a joke or actually serious, and that's why she has big the blue hair that covers her rabbit ears. You can see it clearly in the electric. It's just a big bowling ball. Ah, okay. March has some weird dreams. Oh, there's their house back there. I love the artwork in this game. I don't know how to describe it, but like, it, like in general, it looks very. Yeah, it has the like a really good cartoony feel. With blended well with like being pixely. Grown arms. It's not really attacking, it's it's mostly just dodging. Okay, now, now it attacked me. Oh dear. Oh great heavens. It's not dead yet? How is it still alive? How did that not hurt me? It, does the bowling ball itself not hurt me? 
only its arm? That must be it, because... There we go. Marge, you have some weird dreams. Alright, I don't know what's with you, but you gotta get that checked out. That is not normal. Bruh, it's not even nighttime yet. Hit the buttons. I don't know what... Oh, we're going to the news station. The goons have taken over this area too. Oh god, what is next? What What is truly next? Sorry, I'm not really saying anything. I don't know what to say. I'm also in my gamer mode right now. My gamer, my gamer. I don't know what I'm saying. Oh my god. Oh, you can pick that thing up. That's cool. Never mind, it's gone. How do you even beat this thing without tanking a ton of damage? Well, there that goes. <laughs> I picked up his head and just threw it at someone and broke it. <laughs> Ninjas! Ah! I am deeply scared of ninjas, I'm just kidding. Apparently there used to be, like, back in, like, early 2000s, or, like, I don't know, like, the late 2000s, and I mean, like, 2000s as in, like, 2005, 2009, or whatever. There, used to, there was a big internet thing, or a big thing, where people are debating what would win, pirates or ninjas. In what world would a pirate beat a ninja? I don't understand. Like, okay, your average- Like, I'm not saying a pirate couldn't, but, like, it's more likely for a, your average ninja to beat your, a your average pirate. I'm just saying. God, these ninjas are annoying. They're very dodgy.
Oh my god, what the frick? What kind of ninja is this? There better not be some like special attack button I don't know about. I don't think there is. It's like perform some like special move. You know, arcade versions of games are generally better. The only ones I don't like better is the NES, the, the arcade versions of the Contra games. Um, I think there's an NES version of Super C, Super Contra and Contra. I'm not sure about that. But Contra on the arcade, it just does not look polished. It feels cursed. Honestly, I prefer the 8-bit version. Yeah, I don't know who this guy is over either. I can't tell if he's from the show or you never actually see this guy. I'm not sure. And there he goes. seizures are there. I feel like there can't be many more. Oh, I think this is the last stage. If we're going to the power plant, I'm pretty sure that's... Yeah, I, I think this is the last stage. Because I know you end the game when you... I know the last level is the... It's the Smithers. It's the Smithers boss fight. Holy shit, he just spams bombs. Smithers. What the fuck is that laugh? Okay, the jumping, the, like, the hit you do while jumping seems to be the best strat for Smithers. Yeah, it definitely is. Now he's doing, like, a goofy run. Now he's red, and now he's blowing him. Okay, now I go boom boom. Now he's gone. Okay. Oh god, what the fuck? Why does he have the? Okay. So now it's some robot, Mr. Burns. Truly, truly a sight to see. Oh my god. How is this place not exploding? Oh 
Bro, his legs came off. Now he's just a... Oh, he's got backup legs. I wonder if his arms will come off next. I'm, gu I'm guessing so. There's not really much I can do besides just tank damage and then... Oh my god. This Burns me... Stop saying that. It's at least funny because it's Mr. Burns now. It's like a pun. No, his extra legs came off again. Now he has like... Now he has like... Tr tr oh my god, he has lasers now. What the frick? Oh, it's starting to break. Your days are numbered. More like more like seconds. Cause it's that close. Oh, the arms did come off. Okay, how do you even hit him now without taking damage? He's literally spamming the move. The only, like, free time to hit him is when he uses the bomb thing. So you can, like, get around him. Like... Again, I'm sh terrible at beat-em-ups. I'm not good at them. My strategy is just to tank damage. I always play with infinite lives. I, I I just don't care. How many hits does it take? This final form is taking so many hits, like this last... There we go, it blew up. Ms. Burns, you are not fighting me, okay. So, yay, and then they're back, let's go, they're here. What the hell does Lisa have as her weapon? I don't even know what that was, okay. It's all a happy ending, woo. Well, this game was fun, I actually really like this speed up. Um... The graph, I like how it felt very loose, which was nice, it wasn't a stiff beat em up um, very nice, I love the art style, um, it ha it, um, and yeah, it was a good game, nice music too, really like the soundtrack, um, but yeah, this was a good beat-em-up. I'm being honest, I don't really know what to play anymore, so I'm kind of just playing random games, but yeah, this was fun. <laughs> this was, I did enjoy this, for actually. I don't think this was as good as Golden Axe, Death, Revenge of Death Adder, but like, that, this, this, they're two different beat em ups, like types of beat em ups. This obviously wasn't meant to be like that. This was meant to be a lot more goofy, and I, I appreciate that. And it's made by Konami. It's made by Konami. Who used to be a good company, and now they just make pretty mediocre games. Uh, anyways, um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Is that, there's no credits, right? They don't have credits on the arcade games. Hold on, let me, let me make sure. Well, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Alright, mm, bye.